Hey G Squad, welcome back to the episode of Is and Worth It. So for today's episode, Cool Miss Runner here, and basically what this is is some smart LED light strip. And the one that we got right here is a 32.8 feet long, and they have a lot of different features that's on here. But it's from the brand called Nightbird right here. It has a music mode, so I guess there's like a microphone inside, so if you guys want to play music, it actually follows the beat of the music. It also has a voice control, which is pretty awesome. So that means you guys actually connect it onto like Alexa or Google Assistant, which is super convenient. So if we turn in the back right here, they probably got some more information about the product here as well. But this is basically what the packaging looks like. Let me actually open up and show you guys what the product looks like first. All right, so when you guys first open up, this is basically what's included inside. Let's take everything out. So the first bag you can see inside is one of the LED light strips. Second bag right here is another LED light strip. So they probably got two of these right here. And I'm assuming the total of both of these LED light strips combined would be 32.8 feet long if you got connected together. Right here, they probably got the cable that's gonna attach on the LED light strip. And basically on the other end right here, you're gonna plug in the power adapter, which is included inside the box. So that way actually generate power onto the actual product. But you see right here, they have a bunch of these little buttons that's in use. So there's a power button, there's a brightness button, and also a different mode button here. And I'm assuming throughout the actual product, they have like microphones so that we actually can listen to the music and actually give you guys that music sync option, which I'll test out in a second to see how that works. But you see in the end right here, this is basically where to plug in the LED light strip. So definitely connect all of them together or you can connect it separately. And this right here, they probably got the power adapter to generate power onto the product. And inside right here, they probably got some cable management and some mounting accessories that you can use, which is pretty cool. But last but not least, they probably got a user manual to teach you guys how to set a product and how to use it. And that is basically everything that's inside the package. So it's definitely really cool how they give you guys to actually control the actual product manually on that little button thing that's on the wire. Or you guys can actually connect it on the app to control everything on here, like the different brightness level, the timer setting, the voice control, the music mode, and all the other functionality that's on here. So whether you guys want to use this in like the bedroom or living room, or if you guys want to set this in your bathroom, you can definitely use it however you guys want to. But let's plug this in first to show you guys how to use the product. All right. So I'm gonna plug this part inside right here first. And then the other side right here, we're gonna plug it into the LED light strips. So you can see in the LED light strip right here, they definitely have like the 3M tape. So you definitely remove that and stick it onto the wall or wherever you guys want to set this up. And when you guys first get the product, you do not want to actually plug it in for too long. But for this task, I'm gonna do a quick test to show you guys what it actually looks like when you guys plug it in. So the both of them are the same thing. I'll just show you guys what one of them looks like first before we actually install it, all right? So you can see that once we turn on the product, you can definitely see the light on here. If you guys want to adjust like the brightness level and everything on here, you can definitely can. If you guys can see. If you guys want to adjust different modes on here, you can change the different color mode and everything on here by clicking that button right there. But let's connect it onto the app first to show you guys how to use it. So the app that you guys want to download is on the instruction manual. All right, so this is basically what the app looks like. So you just want to pair it onto the device first. All right, so connect it onto the device now. All right, so now I found the device. You guys can connect it on the app and start using it. You can change the name on here so it's convenient if you guys want to use it for Alexa or some other device. But this is basically what the app looks like once you guys finish downloading it. So if you guys want to turn it off, you can turn it off. If you guys want to turn it back on, you can turn it on. You can definitely change the different colors on here if I see it on this page. So I'm going to change it to blue, red, yellow, green, white. I can definitely change all of that on here and adjust like, the brightness on here as well. So I want to be more bright or less bright. I can definitely do all that on here. If I want to use the different scenes, this is the scene page. So there's definitely a lot of different scenes on here. And right next to scene, there's a music option. So basically now if we have the music option on, that means that when you guys are playing music or whatever, it follows the beat of your voice. So let's just play a song and show you guys what I mean. All right, so you can definitely see the music sync option on here definitely does work. So if you guys want to use that option, you definitely can. And then right next to the music sync option, there is a schedule option. So I click on the schedule option and definitely set like a bunch of timer on here. So if you guys want to turn it off or turn it on, you can definitely set all that on here. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Let me just go set this up to show you guys what it actually looks like. And then we'll come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so you can see that we have the product all set right here. Let's test it out. So I also have the app set right here as well. So let's change the different colors on here to show you guys what it actually looks like. All right, so let's change it to blue. So that's blue, here's red, here's pink, here's white, here's green. And if I want to change the different scenes on here, I can definitely do that as well. If I want to turn on the music option, I definitely can as well. You guys can see that when we actually play music on here, it actually follows the beat of my voice and everything. So let me actually do a quick demo to show you guys what it actually looks like. We play a song on here. So 
So you see everything on here definitely does work. So now that you guys all quick test our pod and definitely see that she does work and it's quite well. Super easy to install and use every day if you can see for an actual test earlier. So whether you guys want to use it manually on the cable or if you guys want to use the app or if you guys want to use the voice control if you guys have Google Assistant or Alexa, you can definitely do that as well. But I definitely love the fact of how you guys can actually extend the cable two different ways. So if the cable is not long enough, you can definitely buy another one to actually extend it, which is super convenient. This way actually makes it a lot cooler for like your bedroom, your living room, or wherever you guys want to set this up. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Not a good unboxing and test the product. Not to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this product, I would definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it if you got one more or need one of these. Especially if you guys are trying to look for an LED light strip that has all the different functions that I mentioned earlier, such as the different color mode, the music sync mode, the timer option, the voice control or app control. If you guys want all of that, then this is definitely super worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have to want these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.